What's up? Welcome to Mother Soccer with Michael Blackson, brought to you by iHeartRadio, Calvary Audio, and the Black Effect Podcast Network. My co-host. Hey, welcome. Chinese best friend here. Calvary Audio. Yes. Amazing guys. No, nah, really good guys, man. We got Keegan, we got Brandon, we got the other fun looking guy. He looks like a, a grown up version of Dennis the Menace. <laughs> See what I got on? I need Versace to acknowledge me, but he's, he passed away. Rest in peace, Versace. Where the fuck is running Versace? Oh, he already Versace passed Scott. away? Versace? Where the fuck have you been? Oh, yeah. I heard about that. Some Filipino guy shot him. Ain't no fucking Filipino guy. The Filipino guy, his boyfriend shot him. Asian guy that was fucking the killer. Yeah. It's who you remember. You remember the, the Asian guy that had nothing to do with the killing. Because he was fucking the killer... And he's Asian. You just remember Asian. You racist, Chinese best friend. Uh, yeah. No, I'm not. But I, I remember that because my mom told me. Because uh, the one killed Versace is, is Filipino guy. I'm like, that oh. fucker is not Filipino, man. He's Filipino, 100%. I know. His gay lover guy? His gay lover is Filipino. He don't look fucking Filipino. Yeah, he's Filipino. I know. Because I saw the duck. He look there. Italian or Spanish or something. We're, we're mixed, Michael Blackson. Who's mixed? He was mixed? Filipinos are he's mixed. mixed. We're, all, we're Spaniard. We're Spaniard blood. Well, he has a whole lot of fucking Spaniel in it. There's very little yeah. fi- Filipino in it, motherfucker. Filipino. Talking about Filipino. Our bu- your best friend, Manny Pacman Pacquiao is running for president. Of what country? Philippines, dude. Is he really? No, <laughs> no. How he can't run for president? He's boxing. Very he's soon. running for president. He's been in the Senate seat. Yeah, but he can't. He can't fucking be a boxer. He got. A, he has a fight in a couple of months. Yeah. How the fuck is? How is the president gonna be in a fucking ring? No, because it's 2022. We're 2021 right now. It's retiring. Yeah, and he's going to have a whole bunch of fucking CTEs and be the worst fucking president. He's not going to remember anything. No, he's anything. not. He's the best president. He gives rice to everybody in Hungary in the world. All the hungry kids. He, he'll be great. He'll be a great president. He's going to be so fucked up from getting hit in the head, he's going he gonna to feed <laughs> the rich, okay, and fucking leave the homeless. No, he's been feeding the, the poor. He, he's, he's doing good. He, I think he's going to win. Um, listen, I have no doubt if he run for anything, he'll win, okay? Yeah, he'll win. Cause but he, is he going to remember to run? Because <laughs> them fucking shots in the head. That's, would you let Evander Holyfield become president of the United States? Yeah, if he still have his right ear. from Exactly, motherfucker. Well, he can't, Holyfield can't hear because your buddy Mike Tyson bit it off. <laughs> beat the shit out of that half the ear. You're only hearing the left ear. And it's fucked up. He can't put a fucking mask on. I feel bad for that kid. <laughs> you're going to have to stick the, the the other side of the... Where do you stick that if you don't have that ear? He has to put a fucking glue on his fucking ear to put his mask on. I hope Evander's not listening to this because he still got hands, motherfucker. No, they, there's no way Evander Hope is listening to our podcast shit. Not Nobody with that fucking about. ears. You ain't got... <laughs> <laughs> he can't no. put an earphone in his fucking ear. <laughs> People listen to podcasts. You see, you're about to go to sleep. <laughs> yeah, it's sad. Black History Month is over. Yeah. Uh, what did you do towards Black History Month? How did you acknowledge Black History Month? What uh, do you think about Black? What do you know about Black History Month? Uh, black History Month is is uh, an amazing month for the African community. It's uh, recognize the heroes, like uh, what's his name, Martin Luther King, changed the lives of every African in the world. What what else is name? Uh, Denzel Washington. What the fuck, Denzel? Got to do a Black History Month, man. Well, he he just name me all the goddamn niggas you know. Who the fuck do Denzel has to do with Black History because Month? Because he changed the history of uh, of the movies. He 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 gave a lot of talent, you know. Kind of recognized the the black community and their talent, right? Who? Denzel Washington. King Kong ain't got shit on me. After that, everything changed, you know. There goes Black Panther. You was doing really good when you said Martin Luther King. Can you think of any other black people that we black black people look up to besides Martin Luther King? 
Um, Not fucking actors, okay? I thought actors part of it because the whole world look at the acting. Okay, it's good to acknowledge black people, period, that, that make a difference oh, in know. our community. But give me someone that really changed black world, like got us where we are today. Somebody that got I me know. in this couch today. Somebody got you in that couch today is... Uh, Don't say fucking Calvary, okay? Ice Cube. Oh, my God. My from nigga. Black Just Friday. Me. You're the African king of comedy. I was in next Black Friday, Black. not Black Friday. Black Friday is a fucking <laughs> sale that happens after Thanksgiving. Chinese well, you, best you, friend. You, 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 you just think about everything that's black, you're saying it. Well, you, you change a lot of uh, people's lives and kind of uh, give kids opportunity. To so you saying you naming me as an oh, influence? Yeah, you're you're a good influence to the African okay. community. Right. I appreciate that. I mean, you 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 came from a small town named Ghana. You came to the United States with nothing. Some guy told you, "Hey, uh, you should perform at the comedy place," and you change everyone's life. You're giving an opportunity for the kids to grow up to become the best. You're you just, you just try. You just sir. think about everything good you could say. And okay, so you got you got, got Martin Luther King, you got, got Denzel, more. you got me, and what else? Who else? Barack Obama. Okay, yeah. now we talking. That yeah. guy made a difference. First black president. First black president of the free world, the greatest country in the world. Yeah, absolutely. He changed. But how? Life. Why didn't he come before Denzel and before me? Why? Why did I come? Because that's the only thing I could think of right now. Is who? Well, at that moment. Denzel at the moment. Anybody else you want? Anybody that you think of that made a difference to Black people during Black History Month, even though it's over with now? Uh, can you, can you give me a hint? Uh, you did good, man. Okay, huh? we'll stick with the, um, Martin Luther King and Barack Obama. I think those are probably did the top two, definitely that made a, that definitely changed our black people's life. How about you, Michael Blackson, who gave you the inspiration? What do you mean? Like the uh, a black uh, inspiration in your no, life. No, 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 definitely Martin Luther King, Obama. Um, uh, you know, my mother, she gave birth yeah. to me. Yeah. She could have easily just abort, aborted me or my dad could have pulled out and poured me on my mother's ass. Yeah, imagine. Things would have been different. Exactly. No so Mike. my parents definitely made a Michael difference. Michael Blackson. He Mother Sucker would never exist. I would never be here running my daddy would have pulled out. Yeah. Your dad, your dad stayed in or he'd pull out or you uh, he halfway pulled out because you look you short as fuck. Yeah, I think uh, I was the milkman's baby. But I'm just joking. <laughs> I look like my, my mother and my father. Okay, and so um, usually during Black History Month, what do you do? Uh, you know, there's nothing much to do, Michael Blackson, because Corona is is uh, was here. Corona is here. Everything. I can't I'm saying to... usually, not just this. I mean, we know 2021. 20, all you know. Oh, usually, what I used to do. What usually Black do during Black History Month? What What do you usually do? Yeah, I usually hang out with Michael Blackson at a club somewhere, popping bottles and hanging out with Drake or something. Okay. Yeah. How about you? What do you usually do? Well, usually uh, during Black History Month, just to to acknowledge what we went through with slavery and all that stuff that went through, you know, what my black people went through, black Americans went through. I usually try to like just fuck a white woman just to just to get even. <laughs> just to get even. Yes, I fuck white women usually. On, usually during Black History Month, when I was single, that's what I did. I find the whitest woman and then I fuck her and be like, now we are even. Yeah, people fuck my people. 200 years ago or 300, 400 years ago, now guess what? I'm fucking you. <laughs> we are even. Slavery is over, motherfucker. You are the hero to the African community. I'm the hero to fucking drug dealers and fucking killers and assholes, okay? <laughs> so, yeah. No, you're not. You're underestimating your your superpowers, Michael Blackson. Thanks, man. I appreciate it, man. Yeah, you're, you're a good hero to the world. That I fuck white women on Black History Month to get even. That's, that's not a good thing, Chinese best friend. No, I, I, I need to be a better person, okay? Yeah, you need to change. Thank you very much. Yeah. It's 2021 now. I'm changing. I'm going to change, man. I'm going to yeah. settle down and... Just like that Tupac song, Change. How the song goes? I like to change. Uh, change. Uh, I, I have no idea. <laughs> I think the cavalry guy Brandon will tell us. 
<laughs> he so, he sang the 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 Barack Obama song. He did the only black president. Yeah, they, man. That's what usually. That's what I do on Black History Month. Usually, in the past, in 2017, 2016, 2018, I just usually just find a white woman and I just I fuck her just because because her great great grandparents made my people slavery. So now I'm fucking her back, and now we even. Oh wow. That's a great idea, Mike. No wonder why. What the I fuck is that it. a great idea, Chinese best friend? That's not nice. I need to become a better person. Yeah, you need to get a better person. But to become a better person, I have a very special guest for you for the Michael Blackson podcast tonight. Who's the special guest, man? Special guest is uh, Danny Banks, uh, Snow Bunny that got away from you. Where did you find Danny? Uh, I found her at the lobby at the hotel today. And I told her, I said, why don't you come over to our podcast? And she said, okay, I'm free tonight. All right, let her in. Uh, Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Danny Banks. Hi. Look at the snow bunny is here. Wow, you haven't seen her in two years. Yeah, it's been a while. What happened to you guys? Hey. <laughs> hey, Danny. Hey, Danny. Hey. Welcome. Welcome to the show. We actually met by accident. Not by accident. So what happened was a friend of hers was coming down to hang out in L.A. that I knew. And I was, yeah. I, right, I was really trying to, like, I knew a friend. I was trying to get with her friend. So she said she'd bring her friend Danny with her. I'm like, okay, I, didn't, yeah. I had no clue who Danny was. And then Danny comes. I just see this huge Christmas ass. <laughs> yeah, I remember <laughs> Michael Blackson. I was there that day. And goddamn titties to <laughs> breastfeed every village. In yeah. the continent of uh, Africa and South America. Like all those Guatemalan <laughs> kids. With, I mean, it wasn't. And then, so we decided you was there, you fucking. Yeah, um, you invite me. I go, oh, my friends are at the hotel. I go, yeah, I go, come. And then uh, I went downstairs and I was like, oh, Mike, you have nice friends. They're really sweet. <laughs> you have nice friends. <laughs> and then uh, I think we. Uh, accidentally shot that video i say hey mike who's your friend and went super viral you're like i can't believe it yeah. Eight hundred thousand views in two minutes yes I, I put up a video of me and her and it was like went nuts the internet we shut the internet down so we just kept playing around with like a bunch of videos and then people were just loving it too much and then next thing you know we fuck it oh my yeah. god yeah that was that was a crazy Damn. crazy video it was like every video you guys post, World Star posted. Uh, and then her friend who who came with her, who I put a got with, just disappeared. Uh -huh. I, Let's she, tell the real story. Okay, tell, tell, <laughs> tell, tell, she'll tell I've been story. drinking and <laughs> hang up. Tell me your part of the story, cause yeah. you know. Say say uh, tell us what you feel about it. So we met on Instagram Live. Oh, Instagram Live. Oh, you did. That's right. Before they even came, and they came on my live. You flew yeah. us here. Right. So, uh, let me guess, Virgin Airlines. Uh, Spirit. <laughs> Southwest. Spirit. <laughs> coach Spirit. Oh, yeah, we flew Coach for sure. I, I know that. But that's uh, okay, right? That's okay. Cause so, it wasn't my my situation. Would have mm -hmm. been mine. I would have been like, we're not. You were the third wheel, <laughs> basically. I was the third wheel. Uh -huh. So, we came and then... The next thing I know, we're like at the pool having lunch. And my friend was like, I gotta go run an errand. We're like, run an errand, where are you going? So <laughs> She's left us. She's left us. You don't leave a horny African man <laughs> yeah. with a hard dick with a snow bunny with a huge ass and Christmas titties. You just don't leave them. And a bunch of liquor. So And a bunch of liquor. So we just making videos and the internet is going crazy. Yeah. And it was just we had so much fun that day, I remember. Yeah, you guys had so much fun. You and then she left and us and we we came She was upstairs. missing. She was missing for days. She, she wasn't missing for days? We didn't know where she we went. Where she was. Yeah. So she just left us here so by I herself. So I just like moved in and stayed. She moved in for like two weeks wow. or whatever it was. She moved in for two weeks? She was here for like at least a week, right? Wow. Yeah. So it's like that show, Love at First Sight or something. <laughs> Married at First Sight. Yeah. Titties at First Sight. <laughs> wow. Ass and titties at First Sight. So uh, 
so what else happened after you guys shot that viral video that went break the internet? I I couldn't log into we, my Instagram we just for started two weeks. Hanging out. We we are. I mean, I was single. She was single, so it didn't matter. You didn't yeah. matter. You know, when people are single, to do whatever the fuck they want to do. So we're hanging out, town, and just having fun. Yeah, you know? but you guys were single, but the the whole world was staring at you guys' relationship. How you guys feel about that? Oh yeah, the whole world was looking, man. Like I, you know, now mind you, the girl, the woman I dated prior was Georgia. Georgia's just body is beautiful, nice. Georgia's like Miss Nefertiti, you know, like Queen of Sheba, like the Queen of Zamunda type. Yeah. So I went from that, and who, you know, I went from that to like a snow bunny. Yeah. And me being an African, oh my goodness, it's yeah. like all the men loved it. Man was having fun. There was a good... Sh- and she, sh- I mean, Danny has a, a huge... Man. And my fans, my followers are like mostly guys. Yeah. You know, and I like to entertain my guy followers. They only want to see funny stuff or beautiful women. So Danny had this huge ass and titties. And I, I mean, after that first video, every yeah. guy fell in love. Everybody wanted like, who is this girl? Who is this boy? Yeah. So we just kept feeding them what they wanted. You know? And then next thing you know... We're in Miami. Like, well, prior to Miami, we here. Yeah. Like, I mean, I'm yeah. tearing that ass up for seven days. Tearing that ass up seven days, 84 seven days, days in a month. Blood infection every night. Blood infection, you oh. get that when, you're, when the dick go all the way into the stomach. You don't know about that. You're Chinese, motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, oh I, you are more. Yeah, you get blood infection, Mike. I give a vagina rejuvenation. <laughs> you just beat the lip of the pussy. That's it, right? Yeah, now. that's it. Yeah. I destroy uh, uh, stomachs. <laughs> so I'm fucking her stomach up for like seven days straight. Yeah, I mean, it's hitting it from the back, titty fuck. I mean, we had so much fun. Yeah. I'm surprised she didn't leave here with like three African babies in her stomach. Yeah, well, you don't know because she got an eight-bedroom house now in uh, Las Vegas. She might have, <laughs> she might have the kids. eight Ghana kids. But no, mm. but we had so much fun. Um, went out and went out to dinner, went out to the club. Yeah. We, it was before COVID, so we, we were just turning up in the whole Los Angeles she puts a went back and we, her friend disappeared. I'm like, where is this girl? The girl is gone and I just left us alone. Wow. You left a horny African with, 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 with an angry dick, with a, uh, with a snow bunny. And luckily it was a few months after Black History Month. So you know what I do during Black History yeah, it Month? Was a, I take my anger on the white woman. I beat the <laughs> shit out of her pussy very well. And that was, that's my part of the story. I don't know what she had to say. <laughs> yeah, what do you have to say about Michael Blackson? How is it dating? Uh, how is it dating the African king of comedy, Michael Blackson? It was a lot. <laughs> yeah. It was oh my a lot. God! Tell she had all kinds of crazy DMs. Death threats. Black women oh my hated God, her. Oh yes, absolutely right. Oh my goodness! The, One time, this lady goes, yeah. "I unfollowed you because you're going out with this uh, snow bunny." We had that snow bunny. one psycho stalker girl always sending me. Death oh, threats. Yeah, and death threats. Emails, oh, wow. yes. contacting like people I worked with. Which that I wow. didn't understand. I'm like, listen, we in a new era. This is 20, whatever we are in. 2021. 20s, second century. 19, I think. We're still on like what you date, what color and race. I mean, that's old. That's played out. My dick don't discriminate. Okay. <laughs> I don't have a racist dick. Okay. My dick is, likes a woman with a fat ass, fun personality, and he'll get hard for you. Nice ass and great personality. You know, I'm I'm not racist. My dick definitely, he don't have eyes anyway. He's blind. <laughs> so stupid. Uh, sometimes I lead him in the wrong place, <laughs> and sometimes I lead him in the right place. But, yeah, she got, I mean, people would, I got threats from, like, women, we, we are going to shut your career down. I'm like, because, what, what because I'm, f- I'm <laughs> fucking a white woman? But wait, let's, let's say this. Those white men fucked our men for years. How the fuck you think light-skinned <laughs> kids came on earth? I'm here. I'm looking out for you, motherfuckers. I'm getting even. Because <laughs> then after me, you continued the snow bunny thing. So I set the tone. What's snow bunny after you? There was like 30 more after me. 30 more? Goddamn, Michael yeah, Blackson. Every post that you did, it was about snow bunnies. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Yeah. You after mean, me. You mean... Me talking about you? No, like other girls. I had other snow bunnies. Yeah, because she, he was so in love that. Me. Oh no, no the he, fuck! I wasn't on. He no, never me, hated you. Don't put words in my fucking mouth. No, 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 no. Come on, Michael. I Bless remember it. people used to always send me the post like, "Oh, look, he replaced you. He's trying to replace you." Uh, for real, with another, I don't remember I mean, fucking another white woman after you. 
Yeah, you, I went to a whole different race, motherfucker. I went China on your ass. <laughs> <laughs> you guys were so in love, though. You guys were t going to Miami vacation, honeymoon for days. But everything happened really, really fast. Sometimes with yeah, things that was happen, real fast. But things yeah. happen fast is not a good thing because it ends fast. Also, you know, it was a great two months I think we had but we were both really busy and you were like supporting like my events and vice versa yeah you guys were in Miami like, together we had, fun. We had I, fun a lot of people were like confused like oh is it fake and then I was like I, I don't know is it and then yeah. it just wasn't <laughs> can you tell the world that that was a real relationship Michael Blackson no, no, because they, they the whole world think it, it was, was just, just a it, you know it started off as just a, a, a skit and this and it, and it turned into like something fun yeah I mean um We thought it was real at that moment, you know, but it was so short lived that it was just it just looked like it was just a great moment in our life that we just Yeah. You know, and it's just just part of our life. You just move yeah. on. You know. But let I mean let's figure out what went wrong. Like yeah, everybody have issues. Yeah. I, you know, I mean our ladies go first. Let's find out what's her yeah, issues. Yeah, uh really what happened to you and Michael Blackson? <laughs> uh what went wrong? Well, the first fight <laughs> it wasn't oh. a fight. Oh, first fight. It wasn't a fight, right? Yeah, we didn't really fight. Never, never fought. We never fought. Fought, you know, when white people fight, and we like, shut the fuck up. You shut the fuck up. <laughs> yeah. shut, shut. When black people fight me, like, motherfucker, put that gun down. I ain't <laughs> shit to do with this. No guns were involved. No, no one was no shot. One. Yeah. Only Motombo was involved. Yeah, yeah. Shooting you in shooting the eyeballs. Was the Motombo. He definitely wasn't shooting blanks. But go ahead. <laughs> um, Mike wasn't always cheap, but he was cheap. Uh, it's, 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 no, I'm not cheap. It's called Stingy. I'm part of the Stingy Man Association, okay? I'm the type of nigga, if you say, hey, man, can I borrow some money? I'm like, uh, let me see what I could do. Those are some... When, AKA when no. AKA no. Or, damn, motherfucker, you should call me two hours ago. I just gave the money to my broke-ass baby mother. Uh, or, god damn it, let me call you right back. Those are all excuses of stingy niggas, okay? So whenever a man say any of those three words, you're never going to get that fucking money. <laughs> But I'm, I'm not, I'm more economical. That's how I look at myself, you know what I'm saying? Um, What's it? Cheap mean? means, to me, cheap means like, you know, I don't like nothing expensive. You like everything expensive. But I just like, I just don't like to pay. You're wearing a goddamn $90,000 outfit. Yourself. I just don't like, I, no, no, I like everything expensive. I just don't like to pay the expensive price. <laughs> That's the difference. If it's 90% well, the first, off. The first situation, mm -hmm. well, no, because you spent money. We did fun things. But I, I had a hosting, remember? Mm -hmm. I had a club hosting. Yes. And you were going to come with me. And I had like five girls with us. And then I was like, well, I'm being paid to come. I can't like everyone knew we were like together or whatever. But I was, I was like, well, you gotta like, you know, we gotta get our own bottle service. And Mike was like, I'm not spending no fucking. Oh shit. no! So he stayed Mike, at the hotel. Oh no! And left me. No, nah, that's not what happened. That not, is what happened. No, nah, we're not even gonna go a, to that. That was the end of everything. Mike will now, never pay for a uh, bottle Mike service. Mike will never pay for a bottle service. Yeah, but it was that's, my gig, is what I'm saying. It should have been free. Yeah, but yeah, he should have been getting bottles. But that's not even no, hell. No, that ain't what the fuck happened. So happened? That was another event. I'm gonna went to another club. Let me tell you, as an entertainer, I've been entertaining for 20 something years yeah. with almost five million followers on social media. When I'm in your environment, yeah, it's your, you should be privileged to have me there. You don't, you know, Absolutely. Me being no, I agree there. with you, but I'm telling you what happened as far as like the promoters who booked me and how the situation happened. That's no, that was I before that. That was before that. That whole because I'm one time went to this one place to eat. Oh, God. We went to the one place to eat and uh, I forgot yeah. some and whoever stopped. invited us. And then Natalie. Okay, well, yeah, but whatever it was. People order stuff, and they, of course, they're going to go to the guy and try to give me a bill. Let me tell you, I don't spend money on in no clubs. Clubs pay me to be there. Yeah. Me showing my face at your club, you lucky I didn't charge you, so don't bring me no fucking bottle, motherfucker. Okay, me posting that I'm in your club is worth more than what the bottle costs. But back to her event, she, she had a hosting event, and she didn't invite me. She didn't, you, you didn't were invite outside this. at the valet with me. Mike, you were coming with us, and oh. you decided you weren't going to go. Because you didn't invite him. No, nah, I wasn't You were invited. outside ready. We just did a whole video on the beach. 
Oh yeah, that video on the beach. Walking where, around. Yeah, yeah, I'm saying that was we right. That mangoes. was prior. That was prior to that I night. I know. But Did you tell him it, you're coming? Hey Mike, you're coming. I wasn't invited. Yes, she you, didn't, were, you didn't invite you were, this motherfucker. You were coming. You were outside, and you're like, never mind. I'm not gonna go. Because I was cheap. Not, I, I'm, I'm stingy man association. I apologize. <laughs> I apologize to all the cheap niggas. Uh, I didn't mean to put myself to your fucked up levels, cheap niggas. <laughs> I'm part of the Stingy Men Association, so I'm not paying for no bottle service. If I go to a club, motherfucker, the bottles ain't free, I'm getting the fuck out of that the bitch. The bottles were free for me. Is What I'm saying okay. was the guy was giving me a hard time, like, we can't just let guys in at your table. And I'm but like, well, he's he with me. He don't, obviously, so it what? Was, I wasn't was in there. We were in there. I, he I, I was, was a janky promoter at the end I of the was, day. I was at the hotel. Yeah, so, so I don't he, know what she's talking about. So I went and did another hosting after that at 11. You know, 11 is open 24 hours. And then it was a thing. I was stingy. Danny just drinks and forget where she's at. That's what happened. And I think she changed now because she has she, wine. Oh, Look yeah. Her. Mike, she, she doesn't let, what drink What do you used to drink? Is it tequila? What were you drinking before? I used to drink vodka, but I haven't drank vodka in two years, okay? Oh, after oh, you since, left, yeah, Mike. Since I leave. See, hey, I did yeah. something good for her. Yep. So Mike made you quit. I made her quit. Vodka? Uh, vodka ration. Okay. Wow. No more vodka. But <laughs> back to her. And that's what, you know, she, she she's a drink a lot of vodka. Because I remember she drink and then Danny's just somebody Danny totally different. Danny go bye-bye. Danny go bye-bye. Snow bunny runs around the snow. Snow bunny yeah. runs around. And I don't know what the fuck, you know. And then she went to host a party and probably got too drunk and forgot to come back. Forgot about you? And when she came back, guess what? <laughs> You you I was gone, and she never saw me since. Oh, shit. Holy that, fuck. That's how the shit ended, motherfucker. And two years later, there it goes. Yes, she is. She found her. And all my shit was in the room, and then you took your card off the room, made it look like well, I, I was homeless. Like, who no, does no, that to no, somebody? Time out. This is what I did. Oh, I, 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 your room huh? was paid for. What I did, remove my card, so she don't go drinking on my fucking card. <laughs> <laughs> Or and let's, let's have card. this established that I always had my own money, so please don't make oh, well, it sound well, like that. Well, you didn't have, if you had your money, that shouldn't have been a problem. Because it a, wasn't a problem. It was just embarrassing when I tried to order room service. Like, I'm sorry. What's you know? order room da, service da, da, da. on my Because I need to eat. It was just the, the room. Oh, yeah. Mike, she didn't mean to. But I'm, I'm part of that stingy men association again. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah. Stingy men yeah. do not leave their cars if, you know, they're not speaking to somebody. I'm not going to leave. <laughs> I'm mad at you. I'm going to leave. Luckily, I didn't check out the hotel. That would have been fun as hell. I would yeah, have that would be out. rude. I, I wasn't rude. You're, I left you, you left at room. like 5 in the morning. 5 I, in the knew, morning? Nah, God Dennis. damn, Michael Blackson. I had Blackson. a 9 a.m. flight. Oh, of yeah. course, I got to leave like 7 o'clock no, to catch a 9 No, you left way before that because I was home way around that time. Did you miss him? She Did forgot. She, I think she forgot where she was staying. <laughs> when she came back, if the lights was off, you probably thought I was still in there because I'm dark skinned. But... <laughs> On and off, I wasn't in that bitch. I was gone. Well, did you cry when you? No, no, but we talked Michael afterwards. Ron? We talked afterwards. No, you like, didn't. You guys haven't talked in years. Yes, we have, motherfucker. We've talked, right? Did you miss yeah, him? We talked. Did you we wonder talked, why? Like I came home for you, baby. Where the fuck are you, Mike? No, first, no. It's, Mike I think, went on a special interview and said something that I said. Oh yeah, yeah. I, no, you know, I'm. But it wasn't. Cause you're sorry about that, right? Yeah, yeah. She, one time we was. Um, no, it's not even true. So don't even say that. What was fucking? Are you coming in the word? What are you saying? I said but that was, just caused me so many problems. No, no, but it wasn't like malicious. Danny, it was. Yeah, it wasn't a malicious way. It, it was like more that. like, you know. But I was just mad at her. That's why I said exactly. It. But she so didn't mean for it in the a, record. She didn't mean it in a malicious way. But she still said the word. I so I was mad at her. That happening. But it happened during sex. You know. But uh, the thing about it. If, if I'm fucking you and the pussy's good, you cut me a nigga six oh, yeah, times. Yeah. But that's no it. Way. The I seven I times. Even, I don't even speak that way. The seven time motherfucker is a problem. But nah. But it, that's pretty much, you know. But I sat down in the interview. But it wasn't like in a malicious way. It was more like, you know, I broke up with her. I had, you know, when I go do something, when I do an interview, it's all about joke. I got to make them laugh. Even if it's in a serious matter. Oh, yeah, yeah. My job is to make the people, the whole interviewers world. laugh, you know. But after that, we spoke and we squashed all our beef. You know, uh, I mean, she told me about stuff she was going through, and I tried to help her through it and everything. So we've been, we cool, right? Yeah, we're cool. And then you guys haven't talked in two years later. No, no, no we've we spoken like in a, probably in the last year, right? Yeah. It's been something like a year. Yeah. I'm like, yeah. hey, you see, I'm the type of person, that's what I think. I think I'm the type that. When I, I don't know, you know, you could tell the type of woman you are, but me, when I break up with any woman, you know, I, I try to make sure, by the time I try to, if I leave, you really must have pissed me off, because usually I let the woman break up with me. I'll never, I'll stay in a relationship as long as I can, 
But if you're if it's really been pissed off, like my last one before her, I got mad and I was like, I can't do it. I gotta go. Yeah, to, you know, get, I'm out of it. But I, I but know usually you I would f- let them leave. Uh-huh. You know, but like it's never bad. Like every woman I've ever dated, I could call right now if I thought I was single and she was single. I'd say let's have try another chance that we'll come back because. I think I have a good heart, and I treat everybody with respect. Yes, I'm stingy, because if, let me tell you something, if I'm the type that blow money, we will not have nothing, because we'll be broke. Yeah. I, you know, I think about the future, and I think about making sure that I'm good, and my kids are good, and all that stuff. So, it's, you know, Stygian Men Association, <laughs> cheers to you niggas. Yeah, you have a good heart, Michael Blackson. No, I don't have anything bad to say, for sure. It was all fun and good experience. You know, like, we, we had fun. Yeah, it was fun. You were never, never treating me bad. And the shit that we did is still on the internet, and I think yeah. it, would, it, would just, it just looked as so much fun. Like I just wish OnlyFans was around back then. <laughs> it wasn't. It that wasn't new. Remember, I had just got it. Wow. Oh. Remember, it just started. Yeah, because you was, was on something else. I was on it for else. like three months. And then I, we did Cam Soda together. He was on, yeah, my, Mike, he was yeah. on my webcam show yeah, with I was me. On w- were you in the porn show? Uh, yeah, no, I was... It I, was fake porn. <laughs> it was well, it like... It was fake porn? Because uh, everything... <laughs> okay. It was like we did a little skit and, it, and uh, it was like a skit where it was her and another girl was trying to like give me a threesome but then they locked the doors. And oh, shit. In, and I'm like, I want some. Of this three songs. It's still fine. It's funny. <laughs> but it was, it was a You've whole lot of fun. It. We had so much I thought fun. how that, that's how you guys broke up because you didn't, you didn't get, weren't no, allowed no, no. to the threesome. No, no, no. I think she would have given me whatever I wanted. Right? Yeah, I was trying to that night. But yeah, she's trying to give me that night. <laughs> I left because you ain't coming. You would have allowed him to have a the threesome fuck, with you? The, 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 uh, the fucking bitch came back before her. <laughs> Which one? Oh, yeah. The one that, the one that they went to the party with. Which girl? I she was, went to the party with another, a couple, a few other girls. The other girl, the other girl that was on the video of the video that we made, the yeah. two girl, it was her and another girl. That girl came back before she did. <laughs> oh, she I came back like out. three in the morning, three, four in the morning. I was out. You I'm know like, me, I party all night. I was like, damn, we actually fuck this snow bunny instead. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Mike was really heartbroken. You How the out fuck I long. wasn't, man? I'm a fucking Don't thug. Don't lie, were you heartbroken? Yeah, we no, had no. to hire a voodoo no, so doctor two times. So you didn't care? No, not I didn't care. No, I, I mean, I'm just saying, I just figured out. So you just washed me away? Like, yeah, yeah, because I, I, I just thought you was the bad guy. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, oh, no, she don't. But now when don't. you look back, you don't feel that all the way? Uh, what do you mean? Yeah, you, you like left him in the damn hotel for eight yeah, hours. Yeah, yeah, I still think you was a bad guy. I mean, I forgive you. Mm. Yeah, I forgive you. Yeah, I mean, why I you don't leave him for eight hours in the hotel? I was at, Overnight, motherfucker. I was at eight overnight. Hours. 11. 11 doesn't close. 12 clothes. hours? I was partying. And she knew I was leaving the next day. Oh, wow. And she came back and fucking, she lucky. All, all I left on there was just the room paid, no car for incidentals, motherfucker. You know how you check in the hotel? <laughs> she tried to order food and said, I'll bring a car for incidentals. Because the leader of the Stingy Men Association <laughs> has checked has out. Has checked out and yeah. he paid for the room. all my shit was still there. He, he paid for the room. Oh, you paid for the room. Presidential but, suite, Obama. <laughs> We did have a nice ass room though. Yeah, yeah Michael Black is not cheap. But I no, nah, I don't hold grudges. I don't. I, what do you mean, Mike? You left you there for twelve goddamn yeah. hours. I was like, you know, it wasn't meant to be. I don't yeah, know. Mm-hmm. I'm Michael fucking Black's and motherfucker. Anybody gonna leave me in a goddamn room? I know average guy. You know what I mean? I'm successful. Yeah. I got a big ass dick and I eat pussy. So <laughs> fuck you, motherfucker. No, you yeah, don't. you're the only. I don't eat pussy. I don't eat, I eat so you're the only much. one that left I'm Michael Black. <laughs> Stingy Men Association don't usually eat pussy. So if you ever give me to eat your pussy, you're a lucky motherfucker. Mike, yes. so this relationship reminds me of my favorite movie, Forrest Gump. When when Forrest got left in a bus stop mm-hmm. for years waiting for Janie. <laughs> Why they wait for four years? I waited what? four minutes, motherfucker. <laughs> that, and that's I was a, done. God Fuck damn, Forrest. I only got four minutes. Nah, you got like fucking hours. But you knew, you knew I was you leaving You were leaving anyway. I was leaving, yes, but you supposed to came back at night. Oh. So I could tear that ass up one last time. But yeah. I, yeah. May, I got a little ahead of myself at the time. And she I was got like, drunk yeah. and forgot where the fuck she was at. Yeah. That's what happened. And it, because of that, she stopped drinking vodka. So cheers to that. Cheers to that. But you didn't cheat on Michael Blackson that night, Ooh, did you? give a fuck what she did. Man. You guys were still in a relationship. <laughs> <laughs> the no. whole world needs to know, it Mike. It was already canceled. Huh? How not what, not, I mean, it was canceled by the time you, you got back. You canceled me before that, so it doesn't matter what happened that night. Yeah, it doesn't happen. Okay. Well, the world I probably stuck my dick in at least 
15 coochies since then. So 50,000. 49,000. <laughs> Give me too much. 522. Well, at least the world knows what happened to you guys because it was like a goddamn time when Titanic sent to <laughs> sail. It was so beautiful. The the love in the air was so beautiful. Everybody was loving your guys' relationship. Every pose you have is 5 million views. World Star posted. That's all this nigga give a fuck about That's is fucking pose and viral yeah, videos. it was beautiful. And not about what behind life. it. What behind it I know, the whole for world. Us. The whole world <laughs> thought it was, it was like beauty in the beast, but beauty in the beach. I got way more <laughs> stress from it than anything. <laughs> but it was so beautiful, you guys' relationship. It was very different than anybody else. You know, it was different. Everything you got. Do you but, remember the violin one with Thompson? Yeah, the violin one. The cocoa butter outside. Oh, the one that the oh, oh the violin. Yeah. So <laughs> when you made me wear the outfit, the African outfit. Yeah, I, I, I mean, I weren't really far. I was. Just, I, I felt like you put a whole African African outfit on me. The <laughs> black American women were so mad at me. The Nubian yeah. queen, you said. It. I, yeah, I put a dashiki on her and said, "My Nubian queen." <laughs> And my dumbass, okay. Her dumbass oh, just yeah, yeah, yeah. dancing to DeVito's song. Yeah, and then DeVito reposted it. Yeah, he really post yeah, reposted it. Oh, my God. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, so I you, was... I, but you know what? Once I was getting, like, threats from, like, you know, I was like, you piss him off some more. Let me throw a dashiki on his snow bunny. <laughs> call her a Nubian queen. Yeah, that and pissed yeah, off the whole black world. Women got, black women got... Not the whole world, just black women got pissed, but... Men were loving it. Babe, with oh, me, yeah. it was just more, I'm just entertainment. Right. Yeah. You know? It was never entertainment. So they, would, they were happy. They, they, the old black women were happy when it was over with. They had yeah. a celebration, a big party during Black History Month. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, it was a very... Yeah, not, you know, my whole thing, I, I, you know, we're in an era, whatever, it doesn't matter. Whoever you love, did who you love, fuck all that tradition shit, it's all played out, you know, um... I just hate people that just want to stick to things. You know, kids bring a different race home to their parents. Their parents look at them funny. Yeah. My mother never been like that. My father, rest in peace. I don't know how that nigga was. But my mom never cared. I mean, her oldest brother's married to some England lady. And it don't matter who date, who you date, whoever. As long as you're happy, yeah. that's all that matters. Yeah. And then the other day, when under the cover of the sheets, nobody there, nobody give a fuck. Nobody yeah, cares. Man. Nobody's paying your bill. Yeah. Fuck all that. Date whoever the fuck you want to date. In fact, I'm looking for a Chinese midget when I'm done with Ryder. <laughs> I know where to find them, Mike, at the supermarket, a Asian market store. Got a bunch of cashiers there that are midget. <laughs> I think they're just short. Huh? Yeah, I know, huh? Yeah. But, you know, that's the history of me and uh, the snow bunny that so the then got after it, the that, got away. you capitalized on it and tried to rip it. Oh, yeah, Michael. How remember. you feel about that? I want to find, I want pictures. There, all the posts. I remember it was like, and then you were doing some oh. therapy session, trying to get over me. Oh, yeah, yeah. That oh. was all skits. I know, but I'm just so saying. So you unfollowed Michael Blackson, but you she were still staring at him. Yes, yeah, you, you block him. <laughs> yeah. like, you huh, blocked me too. But you you watch his Instagram on a different Instagram. People huh? just send it to me, and I'm oh, like, yeah. I don't. Yeah, nobody cares. Of course you care. But you know, my, here's my thing. I'm a comedian. Everything I go through or that happens in my life, I have to yeah, make fun a, of it. It was a lot for me because I'm very sensitive yeah, and I'm a are. baby. So I was pissed all the fucking time. Like, why are they saying this about me? Why? Like, it's actually very, like, fucked up. Like, people don't realize how mean the internet is anyways. And then it was like, they're, like I already have my own shit going on. People being mean to me normally. But then it was like triple mean when I was like with him, you know? So it was like every day I would wake up to like the meanest shit. Like. But to set the record straight, uh, you know, because people were thinking like you guys' relationship hit. was fake. You know, to set the record straight, I, mean, I know it's over. Do you tell people it was fake? But no, no, no. The whole world thought it was just a, a whole fake well, relationship. It was, right? No, no, I, it was not. Me, I didn't fake go, I mean, in the beginning. When I was, let me tell you, like, in it. I didn't go anywhere where the guys like, yo, where's the snow bunny? Everybody, yeah. entertainers, comedians, They were trying to book rappers. us in Africa, remember? To yes. that Even that club. guy that uh, for next Friday, Pops, was yeah. asking yeah, about what. I was on the plane. I was on the plane. Yeah, John God bless school. him. Rest in peace. Rest in peace. Who's the goddamn snow bunny? 
Peter got so I still have fans that like say like I've been following you since like Michael Blackson. Yeah, I think when we posted the thing, how many followers did you gain? You gained a lot. Right? Yeah, you got. Like, I was at like two point one million when I met you, and then it was like two point four in like two weeks. Yeah, she gained like three hundred thousand followers in two weeks. But now I'm like at five point. Yeah, you. Well, yeah, because you doing five point seven million. You doing her thing. You got more followers than. Then Joe Biden, no, the I president of the Biden United has States of America. Million, I no, he don't do he? He has 17 million. I looked. He did. He must have just bought the motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't have like three million before the election. Hey, Mike, he just became the president and of the it, United States. Right. Okay? So then everyone oh, followed him. And, Seriously? And the orange friend, uh, orange buddy of ours, uh, what's his name? Trump has Donald to have more. Trump. They shut down his Instagram and Twitter. Did they? So who are they gonna follow? They really shut it what down. What the? He did not have seventy. I would have. I wish I would have screenshot. Yeah, he had two hundred thousand before. No, he did not. Yeah, yeah. two hundred thousand. No, he had like a mil or two. <laughs> Trust me, it was a very little amount, maybe five at the most. I don't think he had five million before. He, Mike, after he he told the world that he's gonna give away two thousand uh, dollar check, he, he got all the followers. Yeah. The stimulus. <laughs> stimulus check. Yeah. But yeah, and then but you've been doing very well since all of that stuff. You know, congratulations yeah. on your yeah, success. Yeah, congratulations. In what you're doing, which is of course you make most of your money from OnlyFans, correct? Yeah. And guy, I miss like all the women are making so much money there. They because, make more money than men. Well, they are because everybody's home. People need men at home beating their dicks and they need stuff to beat the dick to. Yeah. All their stimulus package check go to the only fan and girls. She got all that package behind her ass. <laughs> oh everybody God. jerk up to her. So congratulations. Congratulations. Oh, thanks. Men are jerking up Cheers. to you. Are you gonna invite us to your mansion in uh, Las Vegas? Well you know she's she she you build a house in in the A. Yeah. And he built a second house in Vegas. Yeah. Look at that. Wow. Thanks only fans. Uh <laughs> I know I'm not a real role model, but um, kids out there, drop out and get OnlyFans, babe. <laughs> oh, come on, Mike. Yeah. We need scientists. We need to uh, travel the world. Boy, no, anybody fucking... Fu just go get OnlyFans and just take some pictures <laughs> of your butt cheek. And That's it. As long as it's over... So easy. 21 and over, you can make a lot of money. Wow. Like how much you make a month? Is it, is it pretty yeah. decent? Can you tell us? I mean, I don't know what... Is this a, is, uh, just a rough Do you estimate. You make at least fifty thousand a month. Would you say? Absolutely way more. more. Damn, way more. A Let, month. Not a, that's nurses. But I don't just do OnlyFans. Like I, you know, do other things. Like you sell pussy. What do you mean? Like what? No, no she I, does. I have a swimwear company. I do a lot of things, oh, okay. Mike. You always Still forget about me. When Muffin said I do other things, just me like I sell pussy on the side. I mean, for the right <laughs> price. But <laughs> <laughs> What's the right? I was price? kidding. What's the right price? I'm no. curious. How much would it take? For somebody to be with you for a night, it would it depend on who the person is, like how yeah. successful they all are. Yeah, all of the above. For real. So you charge like James Hardy a different price than you would charge like um, Charles Barkley because he's not playing. <laughs> <in the game. laughs> oh my god! Is it the same? Price? I am not answering these questions. She's the LeBron James of NBA, Michael Blackson. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Hell to the fuck. LeBron up. James of OnlyFans, you mean? James? Yeah, I mean a, a OnlyFans. <laughs> I'm not even the top girl on OnlyFans. Who's the top? There's one? so many girls that are way like make way more money. For real? I have friends that make three hundred a month, two hundred, three hundred thousand dollars a month. Holy motherfucker! Mike, let's open up OnlyFans. Nobody you think we'll have subscribers? It. But honestly, I make more of Instagram. So like, my OnlyFans is like one fifty probably like right now. But wow. One fifty what? A, a month. One hundred fifty thousand a month. Holy fuck! But I make more on Instagram, so I'm pr promo. So well, we're in the real? wrong business, Michael Blackson. But don't forget, I got to pay taxes on all of it, too. Fuck that, man. I'm about to just pull my dick out every month for 19 But I don't, I, don't do, I don't do porn on mine. I just do, like, regular stuff. You don't do at all? I've seen a... No, nah, no. Nah, there was a porn that went around the Yeah, internet. it got leaked. There's like a few that Was that Michael Blackson on it? Hold up. What do you mean it got leaked? What do you mean? If he shot the motherfucker, how's it get because I don't. That's not like what I. You wasn't supposed to put it out. You just you just had sex in the. Like it it did get put out like from my page, but what I'm saying is it wasn't like that's not like the content that I sell. Did anybody request a view of Michael Blackson's porn? Or no. 
Mike. We don't have one. We don't have no fucking porn. What's wrong with you, Chinese best friend? I was just asking if she... Start up OnlyFans tonight. <laughs> just kidding. Michael Blackson's relationship is questionable. Did you ever go to any of the shows? I take you to some shows? I went to one of your shows. Where were we? Where was it? Remember? <sighs> that was the night that it was all bad. I oh, what? In LA. Oh, yeah, it was LA. Oh, yeah, I was there that yeah, day, yeah, Michael yeah. Blackson. That's when she started. That's when I... That's when the first time I realized that... Vodka takes over her but life. But listen, that was but that was very excusable. That was a we great were, show that day. Your friend's the com, big comedian's birthday was there, and she was a little drunk. Who's the who's that? Was it um the old yeah, guy? The old people, and then the that girl from coming to America was there too. The fuck girl from coming to America. The old lady. She. she oh, Lunel. Lunel. Well, yeah. I love her. We remember we FaceTimed her. I love her from oh, yeah, Borat. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, she was Borat, the girlfriend from Bora. It's like yeah. one of my favorite movies ever. And then Danny was drunk that day and she goes, That's my man! That's my man! Oh, no way! Yeah, Mike, I videos. That is absolutely not Mike, true. Mike, you, you were trying to perform and she was drunk. No. I mean, we drink all day long, so it's okay. And then Mike. I did like, not do that. Shh, shh, shh. Mike. Mike was like, oh, Don't so loud. <laughs> About what? She was drunk I that day. I was in the front row screaming, That's my man. Up, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mike's like, oh, was, I've never she seen Mike. Was or something? Huh? Was she trying to hackle somebody? No, she no. Was, no, she was just screaming your name. That's my man. That's my man. And Mike's like, shut up, shut up, shut up. She was just proud of me. That's all. I got a text message from one of your fans. We're live right now. Okay. They want to ask uh, Danny how's Michael Blackson in bed. Besides bladder infection and Herrick stopped on me, whatever that is. I don't is. like answering these type of questions. No, I mean the world needs to know. You guys' relationship was. Like Beauty and the Beach. I'm not answering these questions. She well, I'll answer how she was in bed. <laughs> but a lot of time, you know, a guy think because a woman has a fat ass, she could take a dick. She could. I don't think she could really take a dick that well. Yeah. yeah. No, I can't. Right, you cannot, right? But your dick is like extra big. Yeah, she can't take a dick. It is. So anyone who says it's not is weird. <laughs> so yes. how long did your relationship last like two as long months as my dick two um two feet two and, two and, feet, and a half days months. two days no it lasted like nah, two like, months like two months I'm like, yeah, it was like two I remember, months yeah we, it was one month and then we had that thing in miami was that june or july was it august that was we started may june because i was here in may yeah you're right and i'm saying what was your event it was june. like june, june july june yeah it was definitely june it was, it was june that? Damn, so it's like May and June. It yeah, the world love the your the start of the relationship and the end of the relationship because we shot <laughs> we shot a bunch of videos. You hired a voodoo doctor trying to you know get a you know forget yeah. about the snow bunny. Well, I had to I had to make fun of everything. I make fun of everything. Yeah. So were you ever sad? Yeah. <gasps> uh, no, I me mean, I was I was more upset when you didn't show up when you think. Come back to the hotel. Oh, not upset. Like, I'm sorry. I, I, was, I yeah. was pissed. Like, what the fuck? Yeah. What do you think this is? But I felt like what, I never really got to talk about it. So. Yeah. Can Can you? But you, I know you don't care now. Drunk and forgot. You forgot about how can you forget about Michael Blackson in I the hotel? I was, huh? I was just mad. Why are you mad? You I'm left mad him at me. For, well, I was mad in the beginning of the night because you wouldn't come with me. I'll never forget it. You were standing you outside with me and you turned around and walked back inside. So I was pissed. That's Wait, a lie. Do you didn't yes, invite Yes, it was him. the truth. She didn't invite me. She didn't yes, want me to go. Yes, you were coming with me. But she you... said it was all girls. I'm like, okay, go ahead. I'm oh, just going to chill. Oh, I'm I'm trying to even think that I even trying to kill some time, man. Like when she left, I think I like took a drive to like the Hard Rock to go gamble and come back at like two. Yeah, in the you morning. did. I come back at two in the morning. This fucking snow bunny. Yeah, like, I thought the snow melted out the fuck outside <laughs> in a ninety degree Miami weather. Yeah, yeah. So I, I was more pissed. Like I just felt like I was, you know. Being Played. used or whatever. Well, I'm sorry you felt that way because okay. I know it's. No, I know you don't care anymore. No, 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 we never were out so to long. like you know. It was, it was talk so long about ago. it. I forgot all the way. It. Yeah, Every, the, everything. Everything happens for a reason, you know. Yeah, we're just probably we're just. I was just having fun, and you were having fun, and I just kind of forgot to like not care about myself all the way. So, out of like uh, how many boyfriends you had, uh, can you what my top. 10 out of top 10. What is he? Well, she's probably had like 10 boyfriends since then. <laughs> How many no. boyfriends probably had since? 
since I was like if Mike was none. Oh, I don't do white rhyme. So, uh, what was his grade? If he was like A B C D E F, what what was it as a boyfriend? A B. See. Oh, A B. Mike's a good guy. That's better than Mike's grades in high school. <laughs> oh, don't get it. B plus. I had A's and B's. <laughs> oh, you're S a good plus. high school kid, Mike. That's good to know that Mike's a good man. Yeah, the whole world needs to know. I give her like a D. D? Oh, because for leaving you in the hotel? No, okay. How about everything else? How about everything else, Mike? Uh, uh, you know, the fun part, and, and one thing I did try to show her is like, don't worry about people's opinion. Yeah. Don't just live your yeah, life. Yeah, because I, I care a lot. Yeah, you care. I'm like, sometimes people oh. care. But it's just it's a thing. Even, even my girl right now like she cares so much and I'm oh like, there's no way people don't realize how much it is no because a lot of the a, a lot of your fans it didn't matter even George, like georgia who is a black woman like they still attack her like people oh. are just angry and they're just miserable people hate other relationships because they don't have one they can't get oh, one yeah. they can't have one so the misery love company yeah. so it don't matter who you're with i was with a black woman georgia still got attacked and they made fun. she went through had to, she had to block people every day she went through the same thing you know Now I got an Asian chick. She's going through that. No, Mike, your fans, they mean it the good way. With The more they talk shit about you, the more they love you. That's how I noticed. Before, when you post me on Instagram. But it's not even, it's not even the, the guys. I mean, it'll be a couple of guys. But like, it's mostly oh, girls women too? that are. Women are so lonely, especially the lonely ones. Because they want you, Michael They're Blackson. They're lonely, man. They're just home with the fucking vibrator. They run out of batteries. <laughs> You know, and they are fucking pissed. You know, they can't come. You know, they're just shoving microwaves in their pussy. They're just microwaves. so much going on. So people uh, are uh, miserable yeah. out there. So you just got to let them just be miserable. Just if you listen, they who you want, just be happy. And and, yeah. and you could be also be happy very single too. Don't You know, nobody's obligated. Do whatever the fuck makes you happy. That's my motto. We learn a lot in this podcast. And the whole world finally was able to find out what happened to you guys' relationship. You just love this shit more. You just got love instigation, boy. You he just does. start so yeah. you are the number one instigator that's why on he, earth. That's why he wanted me here today. He exactly. Hey Mike, that, the first when you guys broke up, you he called was, me and you're like, you're not gonna believe what happened, Chinese best friend. I go, oh <laughs> shit, what happened, Mike? Well pick me up at the airport, <laughs> AA2271, 12 o'clock. I was like, yeah, I'll be right there. Those videos were all real. Like, hey, well, lo- like, yeah, I remember that. I woke up to that. Love yeah. fucking. He loved trouble. He loves. You should fucking be a soap opera director. Yeah, you should. You need to be a producer <laughs> yeah, for a reality show. Uh, fuck it, nah. Go work on all my children and fucking as the world turns. <laughs> Instigator. General Hospital. Ryan's Hope. Loving. <laughs> and and the and the fuck rest. I of was them. so excited. To hear what you have to say, I even hired that driver that day. Remember? I remember. And a oh, driver right. that day. So you could concentrate and you listen know, to my Hey, words. Mike, what really happened? <laughs> If there's any Nubian queen within the 1,000-mile radius, please hit up Michael Blackson, right? <laughs> that was really interesting. Yeah, nah, it, was, it, was it was a lot of fun. It was very fun. I mean... The thing about it, it's great to, like, you know... Recap? Go through something like that and then just, like, not... <laughs> Talk about it. And then they just just move on with life and like not, like none of this, nothing bothers me anymore. Like yeah. I, you know what I mean? Like I said, I was upset that night it happened. And after oh, I, I, when I left, when I left, well, no, know, I mean for me it's more like I I wanted to actually like say sorry because I didn't realize how like fucked up it was. Yeah, you know, like when you're like just living in the moment, everything's about you. Like I'm not gonna lie, like I'm sometimes a selfish person, and I was like, damn, like the fuck, I just totally like you know did that so. Sorry, yeah. I know you don't care uh, now, it's but all good. sorry. Yeah, no hard feelings. Yeah. Well, I'm glad you guys are finally like uh, in in good good terms now. We were, we just yeah, we were. We just yeah, respected. Uh, I respect there, what he had going on. You some know, hard not, feelings not that yeah, she called came me. Up. She, we talked, and you know, she, at one point I think she was like trying to give us another chance, and I was like, try again, motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> fucking right. Yeah. I said, try. Game, are you gonna now? You probably gonna leave me in the desert this time. <laughs> in the Las Vegas desert <laughs> with a half done house <laughs> in the cold. <laughs> We're done. Well, yeah. But it's all good. I mean, yeah. she's out, you know, she out there making her money, doing her thing. You happy, right? Yeah. Do she you miss happy. Michael Blackson on the record? Nah, Do you she miss? I fucking miss me, man. She's out there. 
Every my time, guy, you're I, speaking. I saw a video of like, I didn't get to see the video, but I know it's a video out with like, you know, a sex tape video. The real one or the fake one? Is that, you got two videos out? God damn. <laughs> yeah, right. Was it well, actual? What do you mean did a you, fake one? He has a prosthetic penis? What the oh, fuck Oh, so you, you saw the actual penetration? I didn't see, no, I didn't, oh, I didn't see Oh, Mike, do you subscribe to her? No, no, yeah. no, I heard it. Are you subscribed? Somebody told me. It's only $9 shocked. a month. Huh? You subscribe? No, 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 I don't, I don't, I don't have an OnlyFans account. You're tripping. I don't log on to anybody. I don't, I mean, I have. You some, need to get one. I already told you that. Somebody has actually sent me just. Videos or pictures, a lot of girls on OnlyFans. I don't know how they was. Oh. Guys do it all codes. day long. I hate that. Like, they got the cheat go codes. Your own. Yeah, I got yeah, that yeah. too, but I haven't looked at it yet. Could Is Danny on, the, on, on them? The yeah. ones you have? There was uh, like 85,000 girls. I don't know. That's so sad. Like, why can't you all let us make our money? Damn, why you gotta go make cheat codes? Yeah, I never look it's at it. It's fucking nine dollars a month. Yeah. Oh come on. That's like Netflix is more expensive right. than that. Right. Yeah. Excuse me. Well. It's all good. It's all good. So the last question, do, do you miss Michael Blackson? I know he, you you have your own thing. Mike has his own thing. Yeah, I miss you our miss, friendship. I miss yeah. like Does he make you fun. laugh a lot? Uh, I think we had a lot of fun. Definitely. Yeah, we did. I just miss like regular fun. Yeah. Genuine fun. Genuine fun. But Mike's moody too. So Mike is a good boyfriend? She already told you that, man. Oh, fuck it. What, what, He's what? an A plus plus. Oh, A plus. See, now I went he, up from a B plus. You're an A B. See, you gotta ask her twice. A you know plus what? plus. He just went. The more she drinks, the she more the went, ace goes. She just went to a C minus. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> At least give me like a B plus. I'm not giving no B. You left me in a goddamn hole. <laughs> Besides that day. Mike, it was only 12 hours. Was okay? I that bad? I was no. cleaning the house. I was hosting your guests. Like I was a really good girl. Yeah. Right, and she was close Packing to give me your a, bags. I didn't get a chance to like give me a threesome though. That's the only part I think we. Came, oh, you didn't give him a threesome. We came close. We didn't get. I a would chance. pick out your outfits, pack your bags, like yeah, you know. I did. do I little things. I forgot about that stuff, Mike. But you know when see, you do it's when, a little thing. Now, when you do something really fucked up, make you forget all the good things. I know. Seriously, oh. I don't because care how I was good. I do. <laughs> yeah, she could be the best moment. She would shoot me in my leg. I'm gonna remember being shot in the leg. <laughs> yeah. Motherfucker. Okay, so you just you, like how girls are. They only only remember when the you bad things. You cheated on them. You cheated on me, bitch. I bought you a house. <laughs> Fuck the house. You cheated on me. I'm burning the house down. <laughs> yeah, that's amazing. Yeah. But overall, I think there's no hard feelings, and that's what it is. You could like come back and still sit next to each other and have a conversation. Yeah, you know that's all life is all about. So man. just yeah. enjoy. All, no hard feelings. Don't take nothing too personal. Move on with life. Life is good. Yeah, what was, life making is good. your money. What was your impression, uh, your response when you heard I was coming? I didn't get it really good. Like, Jen, I, Jenny's you know best I, friend, are you I, fucking serious? Well, that's no. what I said at first. You really? Know? And then I was like, oh, God, this would be interesting because I'm at the point in my life where nothing bothers me anymore. I didn't, you came and said anything bad about me. I don't care. I'll just make joke about it later. But she did say I was I was um, part of the stingy cheap cheap she called me cheap which is good that's the truth yeah. that ain't no yeah. lie but because I'm like I'm more used to guys like spoiling me in like yeah. the, those ways so with me that comes with but time we didn't, yeah that's what I'm saying so we only dated for two months when yeah. I spoke to, despite you to go buy me a car I mean exactly. that would have been cool but I'll wait a couple See? more months she went for in that a car in two <laughs> months but she left me in the hotel in the dark let's go let's yeah. go <laughs> cheers to that cheers. She gave me an A plus plus. She got a, a plus plus. She got a C minus. Uh, no. So we are good. Man. We are happy. We are good. No hard feelings, man. Right? No yes, hard feelings. No hard that's feelings. Good. No. All right. That's what's uh, up. That's amazing. Well, it was a wonderful show. Yeah. The one that got away. The one. There's the nobody one that, that got, got away. away in the winter that time. got away, and I just she got away, and I left at it. Dodge the bullet. Uh, yeah. I dodged the no, bullet. No, I dodged. dodged the bullet. How the fuck you dodged the bullet? I was the one I was, I was the bullet. Motherfucker, you left me in the room. <laughs> but regardless, we're in good space. We're in good. The thing about it, like nothing really, really bad happened where you'd be like, you know, I could never date her again. It yeah. wasn't that bad. Sometimes you date somebody and they do something so bad like after they show their true colors. To show their true colors. Mike, we even forgot about her uh, robbery. Or is that going to be part two? No, no, no. The thing with a relationship, and, you know, and a lot of time, Relationship ends up so bad. Whether it's yeah. like you know, you break up somebody, you go doing all the bad things about them, or doing, it's never necessary because you never know when you you have that space in your life. That person has that space. You have a chance to get back together again, you know. Um, so never, never, never talk bad about anybody you date because you never know. 
Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's like, and now y'all able to sit next to each other, and that's no heart. I have no nothing by my heart about her, and she feels the same. Should you date me again, right? Yeah. Would you date Michael Blackson again, if it happens? I'm like, not opposed to it. See, oh, that's my co-host Chinese best yeah, friend, Chinese my best special friend. guest, CBS. the one that got away and stayed away, Miss <laughs> Danny Banks. Can we tell him your IG so you could get more fucking followers? <laughs> yeah, and catch more up with the Biden. Get caught, catch up with the fucking president of the United States. <laughs> yeah. Um, my Instagram is Danny D A N two eyes one N. Okay, so D A N I I dot Banks, and you can find my. Premium contract at dannybanks.fan. That's right. Contribute to $150,000 a month. Thank you very much. <laughs> God bless you. Get me to The Mother Sucker Podcast with me, Michael Blackson, is a Calvary Audio production brought to you by Our Heart Radio and the Black Effect Podcast Network. Produced by Brendan Morgan of Calvary Audio and A King for the Black Effect. Associate producer is Jeff Apple. Executive produced by Michael Blackson, Keegan Rosenberger, and Dana Brunetti.